have the most fun day of my whole life. I'm so excited. The winter carnival should be every day after school, so I could just, like at night too. In November, we were thinking of things to do before the holidays, but our PTO, we had a meeting, and we said, hey, why don't we do something in January when it's cold, people are looking for things to do, there's not much happening. So we thought of this winter carnival. Well, the school set up this fun, all these fun games and activities that all the kids can do, and they can come with their parents, and they can have fun. We haven't, we haven't been able to like do many things like this since COVID, and it's nice to see all the kids having fun. Basically, they take the school and they make it less school, but fun. They make school fun, which is very hard, but they do. I think building a relationship with the school and families, I think is vital that we kind of just like all get together and work together to provide a safe environment, you know, a caring environment for the children where they can have fun. Uh, it's really to get the community involved, uh, not just parents and students, but also the other schools. So Chickabee Comp, we have uh, volunteers from their NHS. We're here for NHS. We're volunteering with the carnival going on at Lambert Lavoie today, and we're just trying to make children happy. We have volunteers from Bellamy's and JHS. I know a lot of kids who have gone here, and some of my friends were volunteering, so I decided it would be fun. So we've had support from the entire community. pop and duck dropper down here and then there's tattoo and photo booth and then there's snacks, hot chocolate and cookies. But then there's another game like right over there you take a duck, flip it over and if it has a mark you pick a prize. There's like this kind of like beanbag toss and hacky sack mix. And cornhole, bowling, the swing toss, the can one. Not ping pong but kind of like water pong. What is it? Like it's at in this game. Clothes pin drop. The lollipop one. Toss the bean bag. I played games. I forgot everything I played. Once you complete the game, you um you get a like a stamp or a check or something, and you go on to the next game. Principal John Endelos uh, actually planned for these horses to come a year ago, but the event got canceled. So my thought was to redo that and see if we could get those horses here so we could kind of follow through on a promise that was made a while ago. I went on the horse rides like eight times. I think that's why it's my favorite part. It was slow, steady, fast. I just sat and enjoyed the ride. A little smelly. There is some cleanup we have to do afterwards, but other than that, the horses were good. Felt like um, a cat's fur. Like it makes them want to come to school and like want to be here because they have fun here. The years go on, maybe it's something we can do for the public as well and invite everyone rather than just the Lambert Boy family. 
Uh, it's, I think it's only going to get better every year, so we'll definitely do it again.